It is an attachment to a lot of muscles. However, good, goniometer, right? You're using that to line up a lot of your, so your knee measurements, okay? So I'm gonna have you lay down. All right, so for the greater trochanter, I'm sorry if you guys can't see me, but you're gonna feel in here and you're gonna know that you're on it by having them rotate their leg in and out and then you can feel it gliding under your finger. Okay, so that's how you know that you're on it. Then we have the, close my app. Okay, medial and lateral epicondyles. And where are those? So of the, of the femur, yep. So you're gonna palpate down your femur you're gonna feel them right at the base of that femur. You guys see? Okay. Then your adductor tubercle. Where is that at? Show me on your skeletons where that is. Good. Yes. You got it. Well, it's a, um, right here. Yeah. Oh, that's right. Yeah. <laughs> Let me. I was testing you this time. <laughs> <laughs> All right, skeleton, okay, right there on your skeleton, okay? So, if we're feeling that medial epicondyle, you're just gonna go a little bit posterior there, and it's gonna be back here, okay? And again, it's gonna be kind of hard to actually feel that specifically, but just know where it's at and where to find it, okay? Then you have your medial and collateral ligaments of the knee. Where are those? On your sides, okay? So you have your medial one, so I'm gonna have her bend her knee and you can feel it where her knee joint is on the side there and in here. So if you're not sure if you're in the joint space, so straighten and bend your knee and you're gonna feel the space open up so you know that you're in the joint space there. And on either side of that are those two ligaments, okay? Alrighty, any questions about that?